I'm Kim Heniatis, and today I got my first shipment of Ace and Rock books. Um, it's it's so exciting. I can't even talk about it. I can't even think of things, but I'll type it in the bottom, like what the Ace and Rock um, group does and what it means to you all and everything. Because I just want to open these and get inside because I think there's a butcher inside and some other books. And this is Lulu. She loves plastic and books, so that's a good combo. Let's see what we got. There's a welcome letter congratulating me. I've been a selected as an Ace Rock star. Woo! Be part of the first ever group of Ace and Rock super readers. So basically, um, they do science fiction, fantasy, urban fantasy, urban fiction, urban fantasy fiction, urban fantasy horror. Um, and then I read newer books and then are books that aren't even out yet and will be out soon. And then I talk to you guys about them and I talk about them on our groups on the internet and I just accost people on the streets and go, hey, have you read this? And then they're like, yes, I have, or no, I haven't. And then, okay, I'm going off on tangents. Okay, woo, Patricia Briggs. Dead Heat. Um, this, I believe, is the fourth one in the series, the Anna and Charles series. I read the first two. I don't think I've read the third one yet, but this is the fourth one, so definitely be reading that one. Super excited. Um, it's werewolves and were coyotes, and that's what that's all about. This is a new one, in the, the first one in the new series by Rachel Kane, Ink and Bone. Um, it's like about libraries, and I could read you the back, but they'll take forever. Um, you can't actually own books, you can just have knowledge, but if you're found owning the books, then you get in trouble, and I don't know exactly what happens, that's why I'll read this and then let everyone know. And if you've read any of these already, let me know, or we'll be reading them. Ooh, this is the first in the series, what's this? This is just a little bit. They're teasing us with this one, it's not the full book, so we just get a little bit, but that's cool anyway. Anyway, this is Jim Butcher, um, he does... The Harry Dresden Files, um, and I think there's a brief show on TV for like one season of Harry Dresden, um, and he's awesome. I've read all the Dresden books. They're very, very good. I would say you should check out him, definitely. Um, brand new science fantasy and brand new fantasy and science fiction from Ace and Rock featuring the works of, and this is just a sampler as well. It gives you a little bit like a chapter of each person I'm thinking. Um, very cool. There's Rachel Kane again, Devon Monk. I read some of their stuff. Um, the other people I haven't, so that should be interesting. Jack Campbell, The Lost Fleet. I'm thinking this is science fiction. Um, I, I do read science fiction, but I do more fantasy and urban fantasy, so this should be an interesting read to, to try. And then this one, Charlene Harris, you might know of her, um, she does the Suki Stackhouse books, um, True Blood on HBO, uh, read all those, they're good. Um, this one is the second in a series, I don't remember the title of the first one, Midnight Crossroad is the title of the first one in this series. The first one was enjoyable, these are a little bit slower paced, um, they got a southern flair to them though, and um, they're good, they're very good, so I'm excited to read this one, and I think, and that's all, so yay, super excited. Um, I'll make more sense maybe in the comments below and actually tell you what rock A stars do and are and stuff if that didn't make sense. And um, I hope you enjoyed watching my cat cleanse herself. And okay, thanks. Bye.